Welcome back, everybody. Well, we pulled the short stick because yeah. Winston C has the best gig. And he gets to be, I've never been. You've never been to Las Vegas? Never been to Las Vegas. I'm so jealous of Winston. You need to go. I'm happy for Winston because he is our foodie and he loves adventure mm -hmm. and he's been meeting the coolest people. And we're going to check in live with him again today. They were kind enough to invite us over and say, BT, check out what's new in Las Vegas, baby. And he's grooving. He's grooving. All right. All right. Yes. Who needs baby group? We have dancing Winston. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Okay. Well, look. Look who's behind me. I've got human nature. And if we, we have a lot of Aussies in Toronto. And a lot of people will know these guys. They are um, Australia's biggest boy band right now. And so much so, they've brought quite the crowd out. So just take a quick listen. On a blanket with my baby is where be. Amazing. Wow. Good morning to you guys. How are you? Okay, let's let's just spin the camera around because you can see. Look, quite a few fans have showed up to say good morning to you guys. Um, but you guys are great. You guys are new here. You guys are playing at the Venetian. We are. We've been there for four years and we're doing our show called Jukebox, which is uh, basically a jukebox of our career from the 50s right through to today. It's a jukebox party, so we have a lot of fun. And you guys are massive down under. Down under being in Australia. Oh. Yeah, we've had a big career in Australia. We were in the 90s and through 2000 with the biggest boy band in the country, but we've always grown up singing doo-wop and soul, so that our show is really an uh, a combination of all that, so it's a lot of fun. Now, a lot of people don't know that you guys have known each other for almost 30 years now. That's right, yeah, we were um, friends at high school when we got together. You know, we were really and then and then you two are brothers. Yes, we're brothers, and yeah, but it's we're having fun. It's a great town to be in, and um, yeah, people should come down and check out the show. Absolutely Venetian. amazing. Okay, human nature. Now, one of the other things we're outside the Bellagio right now, and one of the things we got to check out uh, over the weekend, a couple of things. First of all, the Muhammad Ali exhibit, super cool. It takes you throughout the years, uh, the, the history of the years of Muhammad Ali. Uh, it's something that's brand new to the Bellagio Hotel, and it's something that. A lot of people are talking about but the other thing that's really neat too uh, are the fountains and we got a behind the scenes tour of the fountains and it's unlike anything else uh, anything that you've ever seen before the the technology that goes behind how the fountains operate so uh, everything from climbing these this this tower behind me where you can operate the tower uh, to uh, pushing the button to make it go there are almost 1200 water jets in there of different strengths that run these fountains and and you know for it to be timed with music is, is quite the phenomenal thing to see and people come down here to get married the other more uh, afternoon here someone was getting married just outside so uh, definitely an integral part of the Las Vegas strip and uh, super cool the other thing that's really neat too is the conservatory that is uh, where there's so many flowers inside uh, botanicals from all over um, are, are there and uh, it's perfect for Frankie Flowers and the best part, it's one of the free things that you can do here in Las Vegas. So again, perfect for Frankie Flowers. Uh, now speaking of Frankie Flowers and Adam too, I found I found some people. A couple people came to uh, say hi. Good morning. Good morning. How are you guys? We're wonderful. How are you? Okay. Well, we're going to go to break. We're live in Las Vegas. We'll see you when we come back. On a blanket with 